to the cloth and paper YouTube channel. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. So in today's video, we wanted to give you guys a closer look at our new 2021 spiral weekly planner. So we're going to go over everything that is included in your spiral planner and a couple of the accessories that you can purchase along with your planner to customize it a little bit more to fit your needs. So this is our 2021 spiral planner. When you purchase it, it'll come just like this. So one thing to note right away when you receive your spiral planner, we have these new crystal clear glass covers on the front and back of the planner. And when you receive your planner, you might notice that these front covers are a little bit cloudy. All you have to do is remove the film on both sides of this cover. So there'll be one on the front side, one on the inner side, and then same thing with the back cover, you'll have two films, one on the very back side and then one on the inside cover as well. And once you remove the two films on both of the covers, it should look just like this, crystal clear, very reflective. Best part about this is that if you are taking your planner out with you to work or if you're still going to school or wherever you're going, this is super easy to disinfect and sanitize. So here is a top view and a side view of the planner, it's quite thick. It's a full year's worth of inserts. So we'll go through all of the different layouts that are included. So the first thing you'll see is this 2021 inspired dashboard that comes with all of the planners. And then you go straight to your 2021 planner. So we have a cover page here. You have your this agenda belongs to page where you can list your name or any other contact information. And this year we included a world clock and conversions. After that, you have your 2021 year at a glance. So this section can be used for a number of things. You can just simply use it for referencing dates and you can use our transparent stickers to highlight dates or block off dates in your schedule. So for example, if you are scheduling appointments out six months in advance, um, this is a great place to keep track of all of that information and then you can add it into your monthly or your weekly spread when you get closer to that date. After that, we have US holidays. So a list of all of the US holidays and they're also included on your calendar spread. At the beginning of each month, you have a cover page with an inspirational quote. If you turn the page, you have a full page of grid notes, and this section can be used for brain dumping, pre-planning, you can pop on sticky notes and page flags, and really customize this to fit your planning needs. And then over here on the right hand side, you have your monthly overview. So each month starts with a monthly overview, goes into a two page calendar spread, and then you go into your weekly layout. So your monthly overview has a box for goals up at the top. Right below that you have important dates. So that has date and description. This is a great spot to put down any deadlines or appointments. And then below that you have bills due. So it has date, company, amount, and then you can check off whether or not it's been paid. And then you also have a long monthly to-do list. Turning the page, you have your month on two page calendar spread. So over here on the left hand side, you have a spot for lined notes and you can use this for a number of different things. If you use a color coding key or a symbol key, you can write that down each month in this section or you can simply just use this to write down any dates or tasks that have to get done throughout the month. So here we have a Sunday start monthly calendar and then up here at the top you also have two small reference calendars, one of the previous month and one of the next month and those are great for referencing dates or scheduling a month in advance. After that you then go into your week on two page calendar spread. So this is the cloth and paper week on two page vertical line to layout. Up here at the top you have a week of so it has the dates for that specific week. Below that you have your reference calendar so you can know exactly where you are in the month and you can also do a little bit of pre-planning or scheduling. So if you're scheduling work events and you have your planner open, you can easily reference dates without flipping through your planner. Below that you have your top three weekly priorities. And then you go into your weekly spread. So these are dated, you have Monday through Wednesday up at the top, Thursday through Sunday down on the bottom. And this layout is really great for creating checklists and bullet points. And then at the end of each month, you have a full page of lined notes. So again, you can use this for brain dumping, for pre-planning, um, or as your inbox system for the next month. 
And from there, the layout continues. So you have your monthly cover page, your grid notes, your monthly overview, your month on two page calendar spread, and then you have your week on two page lined layout. And then at the very end of the planner, you also have contact. So it has a spot for listing name, phone number, email, website, address, birthdays, and notes. So this is available now on the website and when you purchase it, it'll come just like this. But you can also grab a couple other items to personalize your planner a little bit more. So one of the things that you can do to customize or personalize your agenda a little bit more is to pop in our interchangeable dashboards. So right now we have two on the website that you guys can shop right now. I'll leave a link for both of those down in the description box. And just like adding dashboards to your ringed planner systems, you can add these right into your planner and switch up the front cover, the back cover, and add them throughout your planner. So as you can see, these are punched and there's a little bit of space left in between each of the punches. So you can just lay this down and match it up with the spirals. And all you have to do is just press down and they pop right into place. And just like that, you can switch out your front cover so you never get bored with your planner system throughout the year. And if you wanna continue personalizing and customizing your agenda, you can also add these monthly tab stickers. So these are made out of a reinforced vinyl paper stock. And these are great because they'll last all year long in your agenda. So all you have to do is lift up the sticker, place them wherever you want, either on the side of your planner or up here at the top. So you can easily flip to whichever month you need to reference. We wanted to create something that anyone can use, but we also wanted to include a couple of customization options for those of you who like to personalize your agenda systems. So we hope you guys are just as excited about our 2021 spiral planner as we are. If you guys have any questions at all, leave them down in the comments. And of course, we'll update you guys on any new products and we'll do a couple of plan with me's in future videos. So stay tuned for that. We hope you're having a wonderful day and we will see you guys next time. Bye.